In this video clip, we will go through some of the different ways that the general model may be used to split flows from a tank or a tie. With general, you can use a combination of your different operational types. So for instance, for P001, we can say phase split, and I want to take all the vapors out of there. For P002, I want to say I want a mass flow. I want 80 kilograms an hour, and I want that to be 100% solids. And then for PO3, I can change it instead of mass flow, I can say I want that to be phase split. And here I can say I want the liquid 80% of that. So you can mix it up if you use the general. If I click on OK and push Run, you'll see all of the vapors have gone out of PO1 as expected. PO2, I've asked for 80 kilograms an hour of 100% solids. Well, it can only have 40 because that's as much as there is. So it's taken all of the solids and it's showing me an error of 40 kilograms an hour. So let's go change it down, say, to 30 to get rid of that error and say run. And now we've asked for 30 kilograms per hour, 100% solids, and there it all is running there. So the general is actually quite useful in setting this all up. I hope that's helped you in seeing how you can set up a general model to split streams in different ways.